Hi, this is Mr. Data, and welcome to the Dataverse, where I crunch the numbers so you don't have to. Now, if you guys watched my last video, you saw that there's some pretty huge changes coming to Neo Network's Skyblock Season 3. And one of those biggest changes will be mining. It will absolutely be the meta. And today I wanted to do a quick guide, because I know when I first started out with Neo Network, I couldn't find one. The That huge, beautiful cobblestone generator was quite elusive. So, here we go. Good news is it's pretty simple, and these are all the items that you'll need. Um, I would highly recommend making a quick, you know, water source somewhere, um, so we can you can always come back to that. Um, also, as far as lava buckets, you will need a ton, a ton of those. Then just any kind of building block, as long as it's not flammable, and trap doors. Again, doesn't matter what kind, but let's get started here. So first thing we want to do is make it three wide. And then we are going to take this, and you can make this as long as you want, but I'm not going to make mine very long, um, just because we're building it all here together. All right, so there's our base. Again, as long as you want, as short as you want, doesn't matter. Um, next, we want to do the columns. So we'll do one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You do want these to be at least seven high. Um, that's so you can get the most out of your MC uh, MMO abilities. All right, same thing on this end. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, same thing here. All right, so we got them seven high. Um, then we want to fill in one of these layers here. Um, so we're going to do one, two, three, four. All right, um, and from here, we want to close this one off a bit. Don't need those. All right. But this is where our lava is going to go. All right. And here we go for this side. We're going to make this one extra tall. And up at the top, we're going to come over here because this side is going to be for our water, so we're going to need a little bit more space. We want to make those at least three wide here. All right, and then <clears throat> we want to close this in. Don't need those end ones here. All right, fill in this whole area. And well, you've done the, the hard part. Now, for now, I'm only showing you the first side. Um, you absolutely can make this double-sided, and I'll show you that here in a second, but we also, for now, let's use our trap doors. Close all those. All right. And then let's add in our water. Oh, looks like I messed that up. All right, one second here. Made the wrong one too tall. Okay, let's fix that here. All right, one second. Okay, this one's supposed to be the tall one, the lava one. Okay. <clears throat> All right, let's close that back up here. Okay, sorry about that, guys. Okay, so let's put those trap doors back. Close them off. All right, and then let's also close all of this up so we don't have any of that leakage here. I can leave those open. All right, same thing on the other side here. Okay, now let's add in our water. All right, and that should stop it. There we go, perfect. Okay, so next, let's see here. I wanna add in our lava. Now, for each one of these, you will need a source block or it will not work. So you have to use a bucket of lava for every single one of these, or again, it won't work. And guys, that is it. That's the whole thing. Again, you can make this as long as you possibly want to, or as short as you possibly want to. And then you can just run through here and mine as you go. Now, if you wanted to extend this, which I'm sure you probably will, unless you're a solo player, you won't need that. But if you want to extend this, we're just gonna copy this portion here 
on this side. So let's look at that here. So I'm just going to make that actually three wide here. Yeah, all right. Okay, and then what we're going to want to do is raise this up here. Nope, that doesn't actually have to be three wide. That just has to be two wide. Okay, so let's raise that all the way up. We're just going to add an extra column to extend it. All right, here we go. Okay. And then same thing we did over there. Let's see, we can look at it here. I've got one, two, three, four. And then from there, we've got one, two, three, four. Okay. So let's extend that out here. Okay. Oh, yep, yeah, that's not wide enough. All right, so we need to go a little bit wider. Okay, so that should be, yeah, that'll work. All right, so let's come back here. All right, now we're cooking. Okay, so let's come here. We're going to close all this off. Again, you don't have to have those end pieces. Right, let's do that here. And again, this is a real small version um, just to make it faster on, on the video here. But you can make this as big or as small as you want. That is totally up to you. Um, and I highly recommend you make one much bigger, um, especially when all of your stats get up so big. All right. So then, whoops. Let's close this one off here. Okay. Whoops. Okay. You can do the same thing we did over there. And we are going to, by the way, this is much easier <laughs> if you do it all together, but we're going to just put these here. All right. And we're pretty much done again. So here we go. Okay. So now we've got it completed on both sides. Um, now I put these here just to make sure nothing spilled out while we were making it. But you don't actually need all that. Those can be open. Those can be closed. It, it doesn't matter. It's totally up to you. All right. So we'll open those back up here. All right. And there you go. You've got two cobblestone generators. And you can make these as long as you want, as tall as you want, and they're good to go. So again, this is Mr. Data, and I appreciate you joining the Dataverse. Um, this is going to be the beginning of a Skyblock tutorial series, and I really, really look forward to all the different um, things we can make. So please like, subscribe, um, absolutely please comment if there are certain things that you don't know how to do and you would like to know how to do. Um, that's my goal, is I want to make sure that everyone on Neo Network knows what they're doing um, and doesn't has a place that they can find tutorials like this. So again, appreciate you guys joining and I'll see you on the leaderboards.